Hello and welcome to Inside Tulsa Basketball with head coach Angie Nelp. And coach, we're going to kind of walk the 94 feet of the season, so to speak. And let's start at the end, kind of. What a great finish to the regular season right here at the Reynolds Center. You defeat UCF. What was important there? Oh, we were so happy to get that win for our super seniors. You know, their last time playing here in Reynolds and, and just be able to step on the floor and compete and give our best and, and walk away with that celebration with our two seniors in Maddie Biddle and Maya Mayberry. Yeah, and those two players are so important at the end. I know that UCF made a run at the end of the game, cut it down to four, and it was Maddie and it was Maya who did the job at the end for you, huh? Oh, yes. You know, they, those two had such a great game, and obviously Tamira had such a great game as well, but it was really a total team effort, and that's that's our team, and that's what's so fun is that we celebrate each other really well, and we celebrated Maddie and Maya in that game, and both of them were huge contributors in those moments. Enjoy winning, obviously, every single time. You never take that for granted. How emotional was it for you to get the win finally? We were so excited to just end on such a positive note here. You know, our team has had just a lot of learning opportunities and a lot of growth over the past few weeks. And for us to be able to feel like we turned that corner a little bit was huge for our team. And so now you've finished the end, end of the regular season and we come to a stop. And now we get ready for postseason play. Mm -hmm. It's the American Athletic Conference uh, tournament. And guess what? You play UCF again on Monday. So how, how, what's the dynamic of that, that you just played them, you've beaten them twice at their place and at your place, now you have to beat them a third time? Yeah, well, both of them were close games. So it was, I mean, we did come away with a win in both of those. We played we played our hearts out, you know, in both of those games and scrapped it away to be able to get a win. And so we know that there's no easy game in the conference, but it's especially not an easy game to play an opponent in the third time and play it back to back right away. So there's going to be some adjustments that are made on their end. There's going to be some adjustments that are made on our end. and and I think. I think our team is in a really good place. I think they're hungry. I think they're eager, and I think they're coming into this next game confident. You know, you 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 go into a tournament and you have to just take it one game at a time. And everybody is zero zero. That is your record. And so going in, you know, as the seven seed and UCF as the ten seed, the seeds don't mean anything. It's showing up and being your best and competing in that next game. That's going to be key. And it's a neutral site, but it's a place you've been to before, you know, you were there mm -hmm. a year ago. Does that help you any that you're going to a place that's somewhat familiar? Well, remember, we have a really young team, so it's mm -hmm. familiar to some on our team <laughs> and not familiar to some on our team. But, you know, all the when you go into, it's, it's just like an away game. When you go into any arena that's not your home arena, there's always some different adversity. You know, there's not the comfort of the home. And, and we also had such great fans here. You know, this whole year, we've had such great support here. I know some of those fans will follow us to Fort Worth and we'll have some support, but it's still not your home arena. It's away arena and so just being able to get down there just a little bit early and get that comfort and, and get our shots up and get our rhythm will be it'll help us in this game and I'm so glad you brought that up the fans here at home have been just terrific this year at the Reynolds Center to help your team oh they've been amazing I mean we feel their energy you want to that, that that fourth quarter run that we made mm -hmm. you know to kind of to kind of seal the game here on senior night like we felt the energy from the crowd we felt the fans and, and we felt their love and support all year and we're just so grateful for the support we have here in Tulsa well we could bring up the bracket and do all of the prognostications and all that sort of thing, but it really doesn't matter. I mean, it's just survive and advance on Monday. I know you don't worry about the bracket, although I'm sure you know who you might face, but at this point, it's just UCF, right? Absolutely. It's one game at a time, and there's adjustments we need to make, and there's some things that we need to do better, and there's adjustments that they're going to make, and I think it's going to be a fun game, and I think we're going to compete. Coach, good luck. Congratulations on finishing the regular season on a really strong note. And uh, go, go get them in Fort Worth. We'll see you there. Thank you. Angie Nelp, and that is Inside Tulsa Basketball with the head coach of TU Women's Basketball.